Finn Balor, Liv Morgan, and the rest of the Judgment Day have an interesting week ahead of them. The faction has three title matches to tackle, between Saturday night's main event and next Monday's episode of WWE Raw. So, let's get into it. What swerves are possible with the Judgment Day in the next few days? Will they even be the same? Here are our predictions for WWE Raw's top heel faction in the coming week. The first title match here sees Liv Morgan defending her crown against Io Sky. The women's world champion could be set to retain the title at Saturday night's main event, following a huge effort from Sky, but that's not it. Morgan's bigger feud is with Rhea Ripley right now. So, after she defeats the Damage Control member, Mammy can announce the next women's world title match for the first Raw on Netflix. WWE is seemingly treating the January 6th episode of the Red Brand like a premium live event, so it makes sense for Liv Morgan and Rhea Ripley to have their next match there. It could even feature a major stipulation to ensure it's the final match between Ripley and Morgan. Either way, expect the Judgment Day member to be forced into a title defense against her biggest rival after overcoming Io Sky at Saturday night's main event. This might end up being where Rhea Ripley finally wins back her Women's World Championship from Liv Morgan. While Liv Morgan is likely to leave Saturday night's main event with her world title, Finn Balor might not be so lucky. His singles match against Gunther got turned into a triple threat, following Damian Priest's return. This may allow for more interference for the rest of the Judgment Day, but there is more scope for an error. Dominic Mysterio can mess up a spot, allowing either Priest or Gunther to take him and Balor out of the match. This would lead to the ring general retaining the World Heavyweight Championship while furthering the ongoing tension within the Judgment Day. What would the fallout be on Monday night, though? Adam Pearce announced that the Judgment Day is banned from ringside for Finn Balor and J.D. McDonough's big title defense on Raw. The Irish duo will put their World Tag Team Championship on the line against the War Raiders. This is an opportunity for a new member to be introduced. Earlier on the show, Balor can tell Dominic Mysterio how disappointed he is before teasing a plan for this match. The prince can then reveal his new bodyguard, as Omos costs Eric and Eva the titles. The Nigerian giant hasn't appeared on WWE television since the night before WrestleMania 40 but remains a part of the company. This would be an effective role for him, as Finn Balor and JD McDonough continue to dominate the tag team division as hated heels. Omos could simply protect the Judgment Day from any outside attacks, with every member accepting him into the group. Well, except one. As one of the oldest members of the Judgment Day alongside Finn Balor, Dominic Mysterio could have a problem with Omos joining the group. He can confront the Prince after the tag team title match and point out how there aren't supposed to be any leaders, saying that Balor should have consulted him about adding the Nigerian giant. This would of course be where he snaps and turns on Dirty Dom, kicking him out of the group. WWE has seemingly been hinting at a surprising babyface turn for Mysterio, so this aligns with what could happen. Of course, seeing him as a good guy might be incredibly jarring. As for what happens after Dominic Mysterio is kicked out, it will be interesting to see Liv Morgan's reaction to this development. Would she quit the Judgment Day to remain with her boyfriend or was she using him all along? We might find out soon enough.